Hey guys, welcome back. Modi101 here, and we're back in Modi Shorts. Feed the Beast Academy, picking up where we left off. So, we have ourselves our very own, very basic, refined storage machine. All right, so let's jump back into the quest line. Let's go and look at this. Fluid storage disks work like regular storage disks, but they store fluids instead of items. 64K fluid storage disk can store 64,000 millibuckets of fluid, or 256,000 fluid storage disks can whole lot okay and so on so any fluid disc we're gonna make oh 64 is the smallest holy joe that's not that bad that's really not that bad okay all right um let's go ahead and see we're having boost stuff in a new system don't want to waste that time with you guys so let's go ahead and see if we can find a 64k just need this guy there we go it actually ate our bucket but it's okay we can easily make that all right and boom there we go that takes care of that and that gives us a 256k one and for now i generally don't usually store fluids in here but now we can it actually throws off my numbers it makes it seem like we have a lot more space in here which we don't but we'll see we can always make a separate drive for that so fluid grid same concept uh we're gonna make another grid and then we're gonna need another bucket and we're gonna need another one of these diamond guys which i did not make okay that's fine I'm trying to be a little bit more sparing with our diamonds so i'm only trying to make these when we actually need them let's go ahead and make this up not a big deal we'll pop back over here and throw that in let's see if we can easily make up a grid just another basic grid we're gonna need one of these guys boom there we go we're good and we're gonna need one of these easy peasy all right and lastly we're gonna need to get ourselves because i only grabbed one another one of these and make that make that there we go and last but not least there's the grid and then we'll go ahead and grab do i have that's still quartz and rich one two three because we're going to make ourselves another bucket that it's going to eat but now we should have everything we need once let's get the stuff out of our hands it's driving me crazy once we come grab this all right so um we want to make a fluid grid and there we go simple 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 all right now that one doesn't really have a crafting thing, so we're not crafting with it, but we'll just set this here just for fun. This can show our liquids. Let's just kind of show you this real quick. We'll grab one, two, three, and do that. Apparently I grab four. And we will grab a bucket of water from this guy. And do we just I guess we just put it in like that? We keep our bucket and we have 1,000 millibuckets of water. And as you can see, that has taken up 1,000 out of 64,000. So there we go. We can store water. It's really good when you have a lot of other different mods going because then, you know, say for like creosote oil from um, whatever mod my brain just stopped, you know, creosote oil or just any liquids it keeps it a little bit easier and then we can come up and we just take the bucket back out that simple as long as we have a bucket we can put it in and we can take it out so that's super, super simple all right the next thing here is cables cables are used to connect drives to the controller now as you'll notice this controller is here this drive is touching it so it is connected to it this crafting grid is connect touching it so it's connected to it but this fluid grid is not directly touching it but it daisy chains through so and we look here we can see this is what is on the grid we are on our entire system we have one disk drive one crafting grid one fluid grid and there is it is using 10 rf i know it says fe but 10 rf a tick to run what we currently have the more we add to it the more rf it takes per tick to run the system so keep that in mind before you go crazy all right let's look at the cables real quick pretty simple uh let's go ahead and just make up a set of these cables 
I don't know if we're going to need them, but these are handy. Let's say you want to run, uh, let's say I had a second floor, and I wanted to run another crafting grid down there so I had access. Or let's say our crafting, you know, our hard drives over here, our crafting grids over here, but we want to have our fluid, our fluid uh, grid over here for these liquids, whatever. Um, you just run cables, it connects it. There you go. So, all right, there we go. And let's just look and see. That takes care of that. Now we will get into these uh, exporters and importers and um, external storage in the next episode. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Like, subscribe, click the bell. Um, go check out the Patreon, support what I do. It's how I make these videos. Go check it out for the details on that. And lastly, go check out Host Tavern for all your server needs. And until next time, thank you guys so much, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!